Today, we're talking about <clears throat> why the Tom and Zelly 2021 movie will suck. Yes. Why will Tom and Zelly 2021 movie will suck? So, yes, Tom and Zelly is known for the, you know, the abundance of, you know, direct DVD movies that have come out. Like Tom and Zelly and the Magic Ring. You know, especially some that come out with the Nutcracker. You know, Civil Meets Whiskers. Spy Crest, and yeah, there's so a lot of these direct DVD movies, but yes, Tom and Jerry is, yeah, I really went over that fact, I went over that video some other day saying, oh, Tom and Jerry is getting a movie, but the plot is basically an alley cat named Thomas hired by Kayla, a young girl is employed in New York to get with Jerry and Mouse that take a residence to hold up before we went to important ready. And yes, Tom and Jerry, you know, you may think, oh, but Tom and Jerry's gonna go back to its Original roots, okay, you know, they're, but they're making it a uh, Who Rain Roger Rabbit esque live action animated movie which began filming in 2019. And yes, there'll be those people who will play this movie. Oh my god, 2D animations back, it's kind of like another movie called, you know, Mary Poppins Returns. You know, all these, you know, Disney, all these, you know, people who only review animated movies called it a masterpiece because it was 2D animation in the movie, which again. Considering that the this is made made by the same people who part the same animation studio who made Scoob, I have no hope for it because Scoob was not a good movie. I have not seen Scoob, but okay, but considering that a lot of people hated Scoob, that it does deviate from its source material a lot, and considering that if you've seen a lot of the newer Tom and Zelly cartoons, newer shows, the Tom and Zelly shows are not as funny as they used to be. I get to try not to offend people, and uh, try not to be offensive. Which again, which again, what is problematic now? Every day changes every day. Which again, you can't put those stuff that was in the original Tom and Jerry because you have Peter after you. Oh my God, Tom is being cut up in a Tom and Jerry cartoon. We can't have that, even though that's what the whole point of the show is. Or Tom's, you know, nose turning into like you know a, you know, hey. You know, all that funny stuff in the original Tom and Jerry, you know, and yeah, it sounds like Tim stories with Colin Carabiner and Christopher Warren, so it's set to compose a score of the movie, and yes, this movie has been announced that they're making it, and yes, it's for one of the movie, and yes, they're, it's going to be another one of those live action animated movies, which I don't know why is it considered a movie genre in itself, because they're using C CGI in the movie, it's not even a film genre, okay, I guess Endgame should be, yeah, I always use this example, I guess any movie with, like, you know, CGI characters should be considered a live action slash animated movie. A perfect example of that would be the Godzilla movies, a live action slash animated movie would be Godzilla because Godzilla is a CGI creation, the new Godzilla movies. Or Alita with a lot of the characters that are non-human or, you no know, our cyborg characters are, you, are created by CGI. You really think that there are half you no know, characters that are fully robots in real life? No, there isn't. So yeah, this, and again, Tom and the new Tom and Jerry movie shows are much more tamer than the original Tom and Jerry's. So it won't be as great as the original Tom and Jerry's. And why would I, <clears throat> I want to watch this over the old Tom and Jerry show? Why would I want to watch this over the old Tom and Jerry show or the older Tom and Jerry shows that was probably gonna be so much more funnier? And out basically timeless when you have this. Oh, it'll be funny the first time, but it'll, get, it'll not be funny after like the fourth or fifth time you watch it because the type of humor that it was in the original Tom and Jerry, you could see some of these ep older episodes of Tom and Jerry a hundred times. For example, there are many episodes that I probably could see, probably I've seen hundreds of times, probably over a hundred times, and still find them funny. That is the, that, because the humor in the original Tom and Jerry shows, except for. Boo Cat Boos and some of the less funny classic less funny ones. But again, though like the you know yeah, except for like those few select episodes, a lot of Tom and Zelly is just the same funny stuff that is like everything that is but it works because it you know, even though we have seen some of the I've seen some of these Tom and episodes probably more than fifty times, they're still f as funny as the first time you see them because that's the whole point. The humor is timeless, and I don't think the new Tom and Jerry humor will be timeless at all. Yes, the movie is coming out in March of twenty twenty one. 
I could change my mind about this movie if if I do see this movie, but I'm just saying it won't be as funny as the original series, the original Tom and Jerry, and the original Tom and Jerry series. No matter how many, you know, the new TV show is not as funny as the new ones because it's all new down. Tom and Jerry Tales isn't as funny, and this movie won't be as funny either. So that's basically it. Goodbye.